inspection of a Citizen M32 model 3M3 with a Royal Mist Collector, work tower light, over to show you the control panel. Headstock. All four rotary tools in the game. High pressure coolant system. Sub spindle. Turret with turret tooling and additional tools in the box. Go over here and show you that there's the high pressure coolant. It is a cool blaster. It's the hydraulic tank for the bar feed. You can see it's a Cool blaster, high pressure. Serial number plate. And we'll go through and just run it through a pace here. I'm about 8 to 10 inches away from the guide bushing at 3,500 RPM. Looks like we're doing a little bit of a wet job here. Just turning. Back working. 3,000 RPM. I'm about five inches away from the spindle. 5,000 RPM. That was at 5,000 RPM with the spindle and the live tools. Looks 
Substunnel is currently running at 3,500 RPM. That's it. I'm sorry, this is running at 5,000 RPM and I'm about three inches away. And the main spindle is currently running at 5,000 RPM and I'm about three inches away. You have a light. Give you an idea, sorry, I don't have a back of the guide bushing. And the noise you hear is right now because there's no bushing in it. See the waves. FMB bar feed that is hooked up to the Citizen M32. Take a quick look at this machine on the inside. It's extremely clean. Clamp for the remnant retract. Okay, and we're just going to cycle this to show you. We just hooked it up to do a cycle. Okay, this is the panel. Yeah, just gonna show the panel here. And it is going through, and here's the the guide channel. This is the pusher, and you can see it's already got a collet on the tip. Okay. has a bushing in the front and you can see the bushing just opened and closed and our technicians not tops line on this but we're getting through it and close that or feed it through That's the gripper in the bar. In the bigger, the bar gripper for the remnant retract release. Yeah, the tube opens. And it opens and closes. Mm -hmm. I see the, mm -hmm. it's going back and forth. Okay.